In this video, I am gonna show you how to cook chicken to make enchiladas. And I'll also share with you my trick for pulling the chicken apart, shredding it like this, super fast in like 60 seconds. Hey, I'm Laura and on this channel, I share lots of how to cook videos like this one and all my cooking hacks and the delicious recipes that my family enjoys. If that's your jam, hit that red subscribe button because a new video comes out a few times a week. Now for enchiladas, you can use chicken breast, chicken thighs, even a rotisserie chicken. Now enchiladas are always filled with cooked chicken and the best way to cook chicken for enchiladas, in my opinion, is poaching it. Poaching it is basically boiling the chicken, but there's a right way to do it so the chicken doesn't come out rubbery. So let me show you how easy it is. Now I have an empty pot right here in which I'm gonna place my chicken raw, right at the bottom. Now I'm going to add cold water, just enough to cover the chicken, but about two inches or so. Now you not only want to cook it, but you also want to make it flavorful. So let's season the chicken water with some peppercorns, but you can also use ground pepper. Then you want to salt the water generously. I do about one and a half teaspoons per pound of chicken. Then you add any herbs that you want, but this is totally optional. First, you want to bring this to a boil, uncovered. And once the water comes to a boil, you want to flip the chicken, move it around, put the lid on the pot and turn off the heat. Now set a timer for 10 minutes. Now, if you let it sit in there much longer, it will turn out rubbery and harder to prep for enchiladas. Trust me, 10 minutes. Hey Siri, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes counting down. Time's up. Now all we have to do is take that poached or boiled chicken out of the pot and wait about five minutes or so, so it's not super hot and it's ready to be shredded for the enchiladas. Now you can shred the chicken breasts by hand using two forks, but if you want really finely shredded chicken inside your enchiladas, the best way is to put it inside a deep bowl or a batter bowl, and then you're gonna use a hand mixer. Now at first, you're gonna go on low speed, and then you're gonna go to town. Impressive, right? This shredded chicken is ready to make enchiladas. And that epic and also super simple recipe can be found right below this video. So see you next time.